to another Inside Music Row. Today we'll check out a new Cracker Barrel project with hot bluegrass duo Daly and Vincent. We'll also chat with Keith Stegall about his music career and heading up the new label Bigger Picture Group. Finally, we'll hook up with Sarah Darling as she is immortalized at one of Nashville's iconic restaurants. All this and more coming up Inside Music Row. I'm Bailey, and I'm so glad you joined us for another Inside Music Row. We've got a great show today, so let's get started with Keith Urban. Keith has written countless songs in his career, but he's just written for the first time specifically for a movie project. His new track for you was co-written with Monty Powell for the heart-pounding Navy SEAL action thriller, Act of Valor. The song will be featured during the film's end credits and will hit theaters February 24th. Carrie Underwood will headline the Nashville Symphony's Nordstrom Symphony Fashion Show February 28th at the Skirmerhorn. The event will include a presentation of Oscar de la Renta's pre-fall 2012 collection. Lee Bryce is already off to a fantastic 2012. He celebrated a number one song, Crazy Girl, written for the Eli Young Band, and his own music sales have skyrocketed with the success of his latest hit, A Woman Like You. He's also found that special woman himself and won't let her go. He popped the question to his longtime girlfriend while on vacation in Key West, and of course, she said yes. Craig Morgan is set to release his sixth studio album, February 28th. This Old Boy is the first new music from Craig in about three years and is his first project with Black River Entertainment since signing with the label last April. The video for the title track stars Hollywood actress Angie Harmon and was shot in Arrington, Tennessee last year. Tin Pan South is ready to descend on Music City once again. The 20th annual event will feature songwriters from all genres of music at a variety of venues around town beginning March 27th. Last year's event featured more than 300 songwriters and over 70 shows with over 9,000 fans in attendance. Now it's time to go inside the song. We'll hear more from producer Keith Stegall up ahead, but as a songwriter, he's written countless hits for major artists. We wanted to hear about a cut he wrote with Gary Harrison for George Strait called I Hate Everything. I was driving home one night, I was riding along uh, channel surfing between our three stations in Nashville. And every song that came on, I just, I listened to about 10 seconds of it, I would flip and go to the other. And I just kept doing this over and over, and I went, you know, as I pulled into my driveway, I thought there's something wrong with me because I hate everything, you know. It was just one of those moods, and as I sat there in the dark, I went, "Oh my God, that's a song title." So I went inside, and uh, Janet was asleep, and the TV was on in our room. It was the only light in the bedroom, so I sat down at the end of the bed and and wrote the first verse and part of the good bit of the chorus, and that's that's the way it started. And I, it kind of germinated a little bit over the next day, and then I had a buddy, Gary Harrison, who I write with quite a bit. And I brought, I didn't have an ending for it yet, you know, I had it, it was a really negative song, <laughs> and Gary gave it some hope at the end, so that's, that's the way it was written. I hate everything. Plenty of artists are fine-tuning their summer tour plans, but you can always catch some cool shows any time of the year. Let's take a quick peek at who's going where and when. Time for our first little break, but we have the new disc, The Gospel Side of Daily and Vincent, up for grabs. If you want to enter this week's drawing for the new exclusive Cracker Barrel project, you have to enter online at InsideMusicRoad.com. Just enter your information or update your profile and you'll be good to go. We'll hook up with Daily and Vincent next to hear all about that new project. So don't go away, we'll be back in a sliver.